Hi, I'm Steve Diggs. Welcome back to Insights. Lots of content at the speed of light. In today's lightning round, I want to talk with you a little bit about how to manage your vanishing inventory. This is our time. Every week we get 168 hours, we get 1,440 minutes every day. What are we doing with these? I like this comment because I think it's true. If we're going to manage our time, we first have to know what we want to do with our time. I don't know if any of you recognize this fellow. He was a famous businessman back in the 1980s. This is Lee Iacocca. He is the fellow who pretty much single-handedly developed the Mustang back in the 60s. And then in the 1980s, after the Chrysler Corporation had gone into bankruptcy, he came back to work at Chrysler for $1 a year and turned that company around. Lee Iacocca knew how to manage time. This was his comment. He used to say, if you want to make good use of your time, you've got to first know what's most important and then give it all you've got. That is the key to managing our time correctly. But here is the critical question. If I only had one hour today, what would I do with it? I need to know and then I simply need to get busy. The trouble is, time opportunities, things we do with our time fall into various categories. We need to learn to hear the symphony of our life without being overcome by the noise because so much of the time there's this cacophony of things that we want to do, things that can absorb our time. But the problem is when we allow these things to take over, we frequently don't hear the symphony. We just simply hear the noise. You see, everything we do falls into one of three categories. The first category is what I call the nows. These are things that are both urgent, they have to be done right now, and they're totally necessary. A good example is if you had a blowout in your car. You have right now got to get that car off the road and get it stopped. That is a now. Second category, or what I like to call the necessaries. These are things that have to get done, but they're not quite as time sensitive as the as as the nows. Uh, this is the thing that we we we're going to do, but whether we do it today or tomorrow doesn't make a lot of difference. But here is the third category, and by the way, this is the black hole. This is where so much of our time gets wasted. These are the needs. These are things we like to do. These are things we want to do, but these are not things that are absolutely necessary. The trouble is when we allow ourselves to fall into category number three, the ones and the twos never really get addressed. And we're constantly behind the wheel. We're constantly behind schedule. We're constantly disappointing other people. When we begin to understand the difference between the nows, the necessaries, and the needs, then we will have control of our time. I'm Steve Diggs. This has been Insights. Lots of content at the speed of light. I'll see you next time.